friend, I better rush to the market so that I get quick buyers. Eh? I hope the prices are better this time. Last time they were bad. This maze would help me pay school fees for next term. Hey, my friend, why the rush? My friend, don't you know the early bird catches the worm? Hey, 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 hey. Eh. Why the gloomy face? Are you okay? You must be a witch. Yeah, how? How come you got 25 bags of maize and I got one, yet we used the same seeds, same fertilizers, in the same acreage? <laughs> uh, neighbor, you're not serious. Did you cut out soil testing to find out that that soil is actually suitable for, the, for what you are going to plant? Did you examine that the fertilizer you used is the one that will work well in that environment? What is that? Oh, you don't know. Ah, now, let's say you are sick. Doctors discourage us from self-medication. What you do is you go and test your blood and find out what the problem is. Then you get the medication for that particular disease. In the same way, you don't just plant anything on any type of soil. You have to cut out soil testing to determine the right seed that grow in that type of soil, the correct fertilizer, and things like that. After testing, then you start planting. Uh, you see, it is very easy. Now what you have to do is put in your application to the village agent, who will come and take samples from your soil, take it to the experts for examination, and then the expert will determine which seed varieties grow well in that type of soil. The expert will send your village agent a message on what he or she has discovered. They will advise you on what type of crop grows better in that type of soil and what fertilizer will give you better results. If a farmer follows these steps, after some time, he will get better yields. Get information about soil testing wherever you see this sign.